हेलो एवरी वन वेलकम टू द इवेंट ऑर्गेनाइज बाई कलांतर आर्ट ट्रस्ट कलांतर एनुअल आर्ट फेस्टिवल ट्वेंटी ट्वेंटी वन एंड दिस वीडियो इज मेंट टू डेमोन्स्ट्रेट दैट हाउ यू कैन साइन अप एट कलांतर्स वेबसाइट एंड फर्दर हाउ यू कैन रजिस्टर योर एंट्रीज एट द साइट दिस प्रोसीजर इज डिवाइडेड इन टू पार्ट्स दैट इज फर्स्ट टू साइन अप at the kalantar art trust website and second to register your entries along with the necessary details so for this firstly we will search kalantar art trust on google on entering kalantarart.org you will be directed to this website on which you need to click on the pop up page to reach here for topics click here on clicking this link you will get all the necessary details of the kalantar art trusts annual art fest 2021 as in the age group you are eligible for and what are the topics of your category of your competition etc after that you need to go back to the main page and on clicking click here to log in you will reach to login page if you are signed up already you are required to enter your email id and password but if you are a new user you need to fill up all the necessary details starting from your first name which is mandatory middle name which is not mandatory and the last name which is again mandatory and then your mobile number which is mandatory and remember that the number shouldn't begin with a zero and it shouldn't contain more or less than 10 digits it's solely your responsibility to confirm if the entered mobile number is correct or not further you need to enter your email address and make sure to enter the correct email address as in case of any must information and kalantar would in no way be responsible if any important message isn't conveyed to you therefore it is imperative to cross check your mobile number and your email id details multiple times and actually every other detail further you need to enter your password remember the password should be encrypted in a manner in which no one other than you is able to crack it and you need to enter your password here and it is advisable to use some special characters along with the capital letters and the small letters then you need to repeat the same password in this confirm password section yeah right here a point to be noted here is the fact that you can choose a category out of the two provided that is self and for others remember that self implies that you intend to submit your own entry on the other hand if you are a teacher or a coordinator who wishes to submit multiple entries you can choose for others now you are signed up and have reached the sign in page to sign in use the same email address as the one you have used to register and remember that your sign up username is your email id now you have entered your email id and password after entering these details correctly you will click on the login button which will lead you to this screen here if you have already made a registration so you can select all of your entries on the right hand side in the form of a list you can click the cross button to remove this portion on the left and can also bring it back by clicking on these three lines for a new registration you are required to click on the new registration 
this link is given on the side on this side and on clicking on it you will see this form in which you are required to fill the kalantar art 2021 in the column of competition name in your cat in the category section you need to select the category in which you want to register along with your age according to your date of birth remember if you have registered for self you will be unable to change the name of the participant and it will automatically update the name you have entered during sign up after that you need to enter your correct date of birth and you need to keep in mind the fact that if you enter wrong date of birth the ch then the chances of your participation being rejected will increase so you are requested to fill the correct date of birth furthermore you f you will fill this form correctly father's name mother's name use only alphabets and space in these columns and be mindful of not using any digit or any other character as it may result in the dec declining of your entry in address 2 you can't only enter the digits you also need to enter your house number followed by society then street then city and so on use both address lines 1 and 2 to enter your details for the address and preferably enter a street name for address line 2 further select your state from the drop down list and according to that select your city from the list under this column further you need to enter the pin code of your area remember that the pin code can't begin with a zero and should not contain more or less than six digits on entering the wrong pin code there are high chances of your participation being rejected as well as of the fact that your details may not reach you you can provide a different contact detail from the one you entered previously as firstly it bears the advantage that if we aren't able to reach out to you through the contact provided earlier we would be able to do so by this one and secondly it also bears the advantage for those who have registered for others as it would be easier for us to reach out to the in individual participant as well as their coordinator immediately after we selected our area and pin code we are presented with the options that whether we are school participants professional participants or others each of which contains some details to be filled I have selected school as I am a fourth grader student. A question is asked that if I am passionate about spreading art to the community you can select either of the options yes or no as per your preference and further select your school name and then class then state and district then you have to enter your art teacher's name too and remember you can't enter your teacher's name in digits after that we need to attach our entry file remember in ease of music and drama the file should be in the form of a url or a picture but as of now our competition is open for painting and writing so the file for the same can be either pdf or jpg whose maximum size shouldn't exceed 5 mb and remember that if any of these following criteria is not met your file will be rejected after selecting the file 
I have attached it and entered it. But the permission was denied. Due to the fact that I have not yet agreed to the terms and conditions. To read all the terms and conditions, you can click at the blue link to read the terms and conditions. And after that, you need to click on the checkbox to confirm that you agree to all of the terms and conditions. As soon as you have clicked it, you can see that in the My Registrations column, all your basic details are displayed, which assist you in confirming that your entries have been submitted. If you want to edit, you can click on the Edit button and edit the attached file. And we won't permit you to edit any other details. As we believe that you have filled all the details very carefully. And you can change the attachment either a writing or a painting if you wish so. To update the same. As demonstrated right now, you can see that I have changed my entry. And now, I will see this new picture in the column. Once you have submitted your entry for the painting category, you can't do the same again. Furthermore, I can enter only in the age group filled in the previous form for the writing category. If you choose a different age group, the chances of your entry being rejected will increase due to there being two date of births. If you attempt to change your category to give two entries, both of them shall be rejected. Therefore, you can participate only in those categories for which you are eligible. Even if the website permits you to use two date of births, our jury and team will reject both of your entries. Therefore, you are to be honest to select your categories according to your date of birth. So, thanks a lot. Hope you have thoroughly understood the procedures of signing in, signing up and attaching your entry to your form for this event that is Kalanter Art Annual Festival 2021. If you still have any queries, you can raise your queries by sending us an email at the Kalantar Art Trust ID on Reddit. Also, remember to read the instructions at our website very carefully and thoroughly, where you will set maximum guidance on the procedure of filling the form. Once again, thanks a lot for watching this video carefully. All the best for the competition.